624, new this morning. I just, uh, I've been in contact with NBC Television. They have told me this morning that one of our Hawaii contestants will be on The Voice this coming Monday night show. Now, we don't know which one. Just a reminder, we have two from Hawaii that are currently on the show right now. That would be Gabriel Goes from Honolulu. Also, Kamale Kava'a from Paukukalo Maui. So, make sure you're watching and supporting. That's The Voice starting at 7 p.m. on Monday and Tuesday nights on KHNL. A big surprise for The Rock, and it left him stunned. Watch. <laughs> Look at that. Oh, my God. <laughs> That's amazing. <laughs> That is actually wow. Drew Barrymore. Look at that, rocking his iconic turtleneck, chain, and fanny pack. The star appeared on the Drew Barrymore show Wednesday. The Rock also showed off his strength by doing squats with Barrymore on his back. Hey, starting tomorrow, Kamehameha Schools, Hawaii Island will celebrate their annual tradition of Ho'ike with a rock opera marking an event of tremendous significance in Hawaiian history. Ku Ikamana dra dramatizes in music and dance the political intrigue behind the events leading up to the election of 1874. It's a tale of choices made, unity forged, resilience displayed by our Ku Puna. The 2024 version of the show, it's gonna have a little bit of a different feel than the original with new choreography and production design inspired by a dystopian future. The all school production will have two shows, March 14th and 15th. Get your tickets 6 p.m. in Kauai'a Gymnasium. Hey, congratulations to Kani Kapila Grill and the Outrigger Reef Waikiki Beach Resort. They celebrated their 16th anniversary last night with performances from Kahiao Lamho and Ledward Ka'apana and A Ne. You're seeing a video with some of the regulars that perform in the only establishment that features Hawaiian music seven days a week, 365 days a year. In the last couple of years, there have been other places that have started to do more Hawaiian music, but Kani Kapila Grill has been doing it for a long time at times being the only place that features Hawaiian music in Waikiki. And I only say that because I want to give credit to them because there used to be Hawaiian music, you remember the days, throughout Waikiki, hotels, restaurants. You couldn't go without hearing Hawaiian music. So congratulations to Kani Kapila Grill, nice job. Tw Taylor Swift fans may be a little absent from outdoors today. Starting today on Disney Plus, Taylor Swift, the Eras Tour, Taylor's version. Ah! It includes a full concert along with four extra acoustic songs not seen in the original movie and a full version of her hit song, Cardigan. It's expected to be a hit of the movie itself. We'll be watching for the number of streams report in the coming days, and we'll see if we see Steve hold up uh, in, uh, in bet. front of the TV. Yeah, my, my daughter loves her. Uh, so, sure. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and uh. that is why. Uh, 627, Mayor Rick Blangiardi is set to deliver his State of the City address tonight. Going to let you know when and where you can watch it and why you should. And a bizarre love triangle is what police believe led to two innocent young women being permanently scarred both physically and mentally. Top stories coming up next. Howard. DOD seeks three times as much funding for combat training in Hawaii. In your next biz. And now, man, I've never seen in a cardigan, guy hugging. Because <laughs> I don't own one. Anyway, uh, we're like 12 minutes away from the official sunrise, but up at uh, Mauna Kea, sun already, uh, you know, lighting up the observatory. And notice there's no snow on the ground. That could change with that front coming in. It's pretty cool up there. 34 degrees up at Mauna Kea. Lacey. A very busy drive in from the west sky, tracking a multiple vehicle crash in Waimalu that's causing standstill traffic on the freeway. The latest updates from HPD coming up next in your first alert traffic.